Guess what? I got a fever. The only wow. prescription is more cowbell. Supposedly, right here at this light, there is something called Tent City down this path. So I'm about to take this quick little journey into the wilderness, like fucking Bear Gorillas or what are those fucking people on Discovery Channel? I'm about to fucking Discovery Channel forever. Woods, Fall River, Tent City. This fucking pat sucks. Something fucking pricked me. I'm fucking itchy as shit. I think I just got poison ivy. Oh my god. Oh. There we go. We got some tent rubbage. Oh, we got one. Yo, anybody home? Hello? Yo! Knock knock! Who's there? Nobody home? Alright, bro. Oh, girl. Well, nobody's home. The guy, one of the panhandlers told me he got to walk up the highway a little bit, so that's what we're gonna try. Although, I don't believe I'm allowed to walk up here. We'll find out. See what happens. Okay, I might have located Tent City. So I walked up the exit a little bit. Found this little path right here. It's not actually a path, it doesn't even look like a path, but there's enough space to walk through. What's that right there? Yo. You ever seen that show Alone? It's kind of like naked and afraid, but they stay alone by themselves with a camera. Is that called a lean to? It's fucking, look at the fucking, look at the carpentry on that tent. That is amazing. Oh, wow, bro, there's all kinds of fucking tents. Yup. Turn the left to this point. The infamous tent city does exist. And the myth is no longer a myth. It is now factuality. Hello? What's going on, brother? The infamous tent city does exist. Oh, they got, I, I, try, I went the other way trying to get in. Somebody told me there was a tent city. I was talking to the, one of the guys on the corner. I got this recording, by the way, because I'm trying to, I'm trying to um, make stuff like this known in Fall River, you know, to help you guys out, basically, you know. Oh, hi. Yeah, I don't want to you know, I'm, I'm sorry. So, yeah, it's, it's not a bad spot, though. No, no. A little windy up here. It's better down there. That guy over there's got a fucking mansion of a tent, bro. I know, he made that pretty good, yeah. As far as I know right now, I'm the only one living here. I don't think there's anybody staying down there. In that big one? Yeah. They, they were here yesterday, but then they left. They drive around in Mercedes, too, so... That guy's driving in a Mercedes? <laughs> with a fucking tent like that, I would, I would assume he is. That fucking thing's crazy. I'm gonna go down there after I talk to you. He's probably got a fucking toilet in there and everything. I can imagine. Yeah, yeah, he did build a little, yeah. Which I gotta do too, but I need a shovel. You got two tents. What do you guys sleep separate beds? No, no, we stay in that one, but this is like for clothes and stuff, you know. Oh, to keep it dry, yeah? Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. That's actually a smart idea. Mm -hmm. I thought, you know, like when when uh when you aggravate her, she kicks you over there. <laughs> you know, it's like sending you to the couch, but it's just sending you to the army tent. <laughs> right. Um, but I just wanted to um first start off with uh finding out like, you know, uh, why or how you're in this this area, the situation you're at. You know, if you this is where you want to be, or if it's just not where you want to be. You know, and just let um let um people know.
um, you know, your situation and whatnot? Yeah. Well, basically, I lost my job a couple years ago, and uh, I started living out here with a couple of friends. I, I, I hooked up with a couple of, probably the wrong crowd or whatever, but yep. I eventually found this spot over here. They, they invited me over, and I was living here for a while, you know. Uh, I had a couple other roommates. I've lived with other people, you know. I've had little uh, side jobs that I've done, so I, I do make money once in a while. Uh, but yeah, basically, uh, this is my fallback spot. I mean, you got Walmart right there, Red's up there, you can't go wrong, you know. So it's a pretty good, decent spot. There's other spots out there, but they're far away from everything, so. Yeah, right here, like you see, you got Walmart, you got the Packy. You, yeah. you know, at night you got you need a little brew, stay warm, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Man, you got the whole setup in there. Let me make sure I don't get it on camera. Mm -hmm. You guys got like a nice little house in there. So, um, I was down earlier talking to um, people on the Ave, panhandling and whatnot, um, and they told me their story. Some of them's addiction, some of them mental, um, yeah, mental issues. Um, like, what do you, what do you, what are you doing for money right now? Is that is that something you do also down there? Yeah, once in a while, if I need it, yeah, I'll go up. Yeah, and you got you got to get by, bro. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. No, I get food stamps, so you know, I eat. You know. Wait, but do you want to be in this situation? No, I don't want to be in this situation. Like she was saying, you don't want to be in this position. What no. what what could it? What could you do to like get out of it? Get what do you out think? Of it is, yeah, yeah, trying to keep my phone charged so I can. You know, try to actually apply for jobs, and you know, uh, which I've done. I've done a, a lot of applications. And, How's that going? Yeah, it's, I've had a couple of interviews, but it was far away, and it's hard to walk. So. You look like you. You look like the. I told a guy earlier this shining too. What happened to you? <laughs> I walked into a fucking tree branch. No, you didn't get. Night. You didn't get into a no, no, fight over no. territory down here, no. ten city territory. No, I mean you walk <laughs> around here at night sometimes and you get lost in the fucking paths. Whacked you. Whacked my eye into a and tree limb, you know. It wasn't you, right? You didn't give him the black eye, did you? She what? Well, you did? Yeah. She, <laughs> she did. See, I told you that's what that other tent's for. She gave you a shine and you say, I gotta give her ideas. <laughs> set up another tent. Don't give her ideas. So so you so you're looking for work, right? Yeah. So I just wanna like anybody that does actually watch this, I only have like eight hundred subscribers, I don't have that many people, but on YouTube. Um anybody that does watch it, what message, you know, for them, like you're looking for work, my name is whatever, I'm looking for work and your skills or anything like that. If you wanna let anybody know, let them know now. Maybe they, they come down here, find you, help you. Nah, I'd rather not be yeah. No. You, you don't, you're not looking for work? I am looking for work, but I wouldn't want to put it on long blast on YouTube for what, you know? Like well, YouTube. if somebody somebody help you out, you know? If, you, yeah. if you're looking for work, you said you're applying places, right? Yeah. Maybe there's a guy that needs a laborer. Yeah, no, I can, yeah. I'll ask around if I had to do that, yeah. I, I mean, what, uh, wait, what is the YouTube channel anyway? Uh, your boy Local TV. You better click subscribe if you're gonna search it up. You can't. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, that's me. Click that little red button right there. Um, Bye, y'all. Nice. All right. Yeah. Yeah, I got Jay Gumby. But yeah, man. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna get out of here. But where's my? Yeah. So I said I I throw you. I throw you a few bucks. Yeah. You wanna just hold that? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, bro, so... I didn't know these new cameras did that, huh? Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, what, <laughs> so I, uh, I was... Sorry, I'll give you guys five bucks, but I'll just give you one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so there's ten, so there's five for each of you, all right? All right, thank you very much. All right? Thank you. So yeah. I just want to make sure people know I'm not coming down here to make a joke with people. I'm coming no, down here no, to hook right. you guys up. Just trying to help out and, uh, yeah. You make sure he gives you half of that. <laughs> <laughs> if not, he's in the fucking other tent, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, brother. You guys stay safe. All right, so we talked to those people. Now we come down. Look at this fucking guy. This is fucking creative, bro. This is a lean-to. According to that fellow up there, though, this guy's got a fucking Mercedes. So it makes sense that he would build something. Look at this. Look at the craftsmanship. Look at this thing. He's got a fucking table or a bench. Look at this fucking guy. Look at that. He's got his bed. He's got the bed.
He's and got a nice drink next to the bed in the middle of the night, a natty. He's got a fucking swing or whatever that is. I don't know. A sex swing? No idea what that's used for, but. Maybe it's an alarm clock. That's what it is. Oh. Maybe it's an alarm clock. You go like this. You set it over here with a string, you tie it up. Yeah, this is an alarm clock. So you tie the string and eventually the string unwinds it and it lets you sleep an hour and then it goes BAM! Oh, oh, I broke it. I gotta go. Oh, he's gonna be mad. I broke his fucking alarm clock. Fucking 10 city, bro. Hope I don't step in any human shit. You see, you walk your kids down these paths, taking the kids on a nice cute little hike. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Hey, mommy, let's go for a hike. Mommy, let's uh, walk down the water and do some exercises. Yeah, and like a hundred steps to your right. Down this path, you have like four or five people who live in the woods. So when you're out there, this message is for people, not just you people, but mostly for the people that run this city. So when you're home watching YouTube or sitting in your offices, or you're coming down for a hike, on this path, just know that there's people down here who may not want help, but need help. You know, so, and don't just say, tell them to get a job. You know, there's people that could make a difference. If this is Fall River and it's supposed to be beautiful Fall River, and we don't want to be like them other cities, maybe we should do something about it. I got a fever. The only prescription is more cowbell. Let's go.